What is up guys? Razor here. Welcome back to Star Ocean Second Evolution for the PSP. So I need to recap last episode. In the last episode I got the bandit gloves. Or thieves gloves I mean. They costed me 40,000 full. And I got 40,000 full by putting points into purity and we also got determination in the last episode as well and I told you guys to max out determination first so immediately when you get determination put all the points into it as you can tell I got Rena and Razor's determination maxed out and Selena have it to level 8 And for those of you who don't know what purity does, every time you put a point into this, you get you get full every time you level it up. And the higher the level purity, the more full you'll get. I got seventy eight thousand full, plus I spent the forty thousand in the last episode, so yeah, you can get a ton of full. And it's only really useful at the beginning of the game. Obviously, you'll get so much money later on, it won't even matter. But at the beginning, it's really nice. But anyway, we got the Thief's Clubs. Uh, let me go to Specialty here. Or maybe it's... Yeah, right here. Pickpocketing. The special ability to steal from others by pressing square while wearing a special glove can you be tempted into crime and to get this higher level you need to power up courage and poker face and as you can tell I got my courage and poker face level 5 so that means my pickpocketing is level 5 so if I get courage and poker face up to 6 it'll be level 6 if I get courage and poker face to 7 it'll be level 7 there you go that's how it works And that's what we need. We need at least four or five poke, uh, four or five pickpocketing. We need the thieves' gloves, and we also need a particular talent which we got earlier, a uh, nimble fingers. I told you guys in episode one that you needed this. It's called dexterity in the other versions of the game. In Star Ocean uh, Second Story, it's called uh, Dexterity. But in this version, it's called uh, Nimble Fingers. Anyway, now we're going to head to uh, the town we have to go to for the storyline. And we're going to need pickpocketing. Oops, look out. We can so do that's this. why I got it. gonna take a while to get there because it's quite a long ways away but we'll get there oh it's these guys again here goes once I get Selene's intelligence up more she'll be doing more damage but right now her damage is really low Oh wait, I did want to go back. Oh crap. Yeah, let me go do that real quick, guys. Uh, let me speed this up some. I wanted to go back to Cross. Uh, because I want to buy everything that's there. There we go. Sorry that I had to fast forward, but I want to go here and we want to buy this because this is an upgrade broadsword. I guess I'll go ahead and buy this. I mean, why not? 
I got plenty of money. Get padded armor as well. Oh, we already have. I get one pair of boots for Selene. And I already have the iron greaves. I guess I'll equip the pin heels because those are better. Equip the broadsword. Equip the padded armor. Okay. I'm gonna go by the. I already bought all the skills in the last episode. Let's go by the restaurant and buy everything here. I'm just gonna buy one of everything. Just to say I have it. I'll buy more of those later. I'll probably go back there and buy more of those later on, though. I'm also going to go back to the other shops and make sure I bought everything in the other shops, too, that we've been to. So I'll be right back after I do that. Alright, I'm back here at the bridge. Let's go ahead and go across here and continue on to the next town. But yeah, I do highly recommend that you get pickpocketing before coming here. Oh, enemies. Here goes. So yeah, basically do everything I did in the last episode and yeah, you'll be set. And I basically described everything I did in the last episode, and in, in this episode anyway, so. Alright, so now what we want to do is save our game. I'd probably do multiple saves. I'm gonna, that's what I'm going to do anyway. And I'm also going to make a save state out here as well. Now, when you go to this town, make sure to do private action. Don't enter the area normally. Make sure to press private action. So press square. There you go. Okay. So we're going to go out to the mischief accessory. Uh, that's the first thing we're going to do. We need to talk to Philia. Look for a girl in a purple clock. When you go to the center of town, which is right here, I believe. And I believe it's that woman right there. Residents of Curric. Yeah, her right there, I bet. At once. A great storm of destruction is on its way towards Curric at this very moment. What's going on here? This woman was just shouting some nonsense. She is claiming that Curric is about to be completely destroyed and that the only way to survive is to get away from the town right now. Well, that's silly. How could that possibly happen? There is still time to act. Please, you must begin evacuating at once. There is not much time left. I beg you. Please, you must believe me. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Poor girl. Something must have gone loose in her head. <laughs> I 
All right. Let me make another save state. In case I screw something up here. But I think it's her. So let's just try to pickpocket her. Sprite bracelet. Is that it? Because it's a different name in this game. Mystical bracelet that brings a bit of fortune to the where no, this isn't it doubles earth damage okay so the sprites bracelet is the mischief they just change the name of it in this game but if we run around we'll get random items as you can tell even get money too and if you do speed I guess you don't get anything. Oh, there you go. So you can really rack up the money if you use the speed up button. So yeah, it's you'll definitely get your money's back for the bandit's gloves. Alright, so in this version of the game, Star Wars and Second Evolution, if you pickpocket during private actions... You actually lose affection with your party members. In second story, if you pickpocket during private actions, there is no change to affection. So one thing to keep in mind, if you pickpocket a lot, you'll lose affection. I'm not worried about that because all affection does is determine your ending that you'll get. No, I don't really care about that. So I'm going to pickpocket quite a bit. Let me get a silver amulet. Pickpocket failed, so I'm going to... Do that again. Okay, it's failing against her, but it works on this guy. I need to mess with the RNG a little bit, probably. I could probably get her item as well. Let's see if I can get somebody else's stuff. Okay, it fails against him. Works on her, though. Um, you only get pickpocket once per character, so if you fail, you don't get, you can never get anything from that character ever again. Orange Sherbert. Let's try this person again. I got it, Ring of the Accursed, nice. Let's see, we got, wow, a cursed ring still popular due to the considerable protection it offers, doubles earth, fire, wind, and dark damage. Look at the defense on that thing, wow. We got a silver amulet too, where's that silver amulet that we got? Can it not be equipped on him? No, anyway, he stole from the... Let's try this dude again. Yep, got it that time. Silver Cross. What does that do? A holy silver cross that protects the wearer, has light damage, doubles fire damage. Raise the spell damage inflicted by the wearer. Whoa, that's really good. Orange Sherbert restores hit points.
And again, this is going to lower my uh, affection of everybody, but that's okay. Hot cake. I like to get a lot of items. This is really awesome to do. A mixture made of flour, sugar, baking powder, eggs, and milk. Fried into flat circular cakes. Experience card. A magical card imbued with mystical powers that allows the party to gain twice as much EXP as usual. Wow, is that an accessory? Or is it something you just use? As you can tell, we're getting money and stuff. Amulet of anti venom. Come in, come in. Let me tell you your fortune. A good light shines on you from above. Just remember to do your best at all times. Okay. Whatever you say. Let's try to loot the party members. Let me save it. Ah. Uh, see it. Okay, there we go. Oh, Ruby Wan, nice. Let me save it like right behind her and then see if it like There we go, got it that time. Fruit syrup. So I gotta keep resetting, but Ooh, that's actually really good. 45% of the users HP and MP. The rod enhanced with a ruby embedded at the top. Okay, let me save it again. Sorry I'm being a save, save scummer, but... I want to show you guys what you can pickpocket and stuff. Come on. Oh, let's try this girl. Nope. Maybe I should leave and come back. Yeah, see, if you try it again, you can't do it. Dang. I keep failing. Huh, got got her got her though. Let me make a state here on three. There we go, egg sandwich. There you go. Took me a few tries, but I got it. A generous amount of boiled eggs. Mashed between two slices of bread. I like egg sandwiches, I'm not going to lie. If you guys don't like egg sandwiches, there's something wrong with you. I can't make up my mind about what I want. Hello, how would you like some fresh bread that's just come out of the oven? You can buy egg sandwiches here, actually. Let's max out on vegetables. Because they're cheap. Eggs and dairy as well. Mainly for later in the game. I'll just max out on all this stuff. Whatever. Sh sure. I can get plenty of money as you can tell. I've been getting a lot of money from the mischief thing and... All that stuff. Alright, so we looted everybody here. So let's loot some people around here. Buddy Driver. 
so many new items here, guys. A tangy mix of tomato juice, orange juice, lime juice, and soda water. Restores MP. Make a state here. Kind of block this dude's path so he can't. Where are you going, dude? I'm trying to loot you. There we go. Now let me... Oop. Treasure card. A magical card imbued with clairvoyance that makes it easier to find treasure. Okay, I have no clue what that does. Deadly poison bomb. Herbal potion. So many new items. Magical potion that restores 30% of the user's MP. Ah. Uh. Come on. No, it's not 100% fail. Uh, one thing you have to do, you have to pickpocket these people now because, well, I don't want to spoil it, but just trust me, you need to pickpocket people now. In this, t in this town anyway. This dude's being a bit of a hassle, though. Come on. Right, let me try this dude over here, then. Make another safe state. Fail. Darn, can't get those two for some reason. If I come back. Leave and then come back. Stress some of these people over here. <laughs> Still from the kids. Ah. Uh. Apple crepe. A crepe filled with apple slices fried in butter. Sounds healthy. Ah, uh, so hard to pickpocket from some people. You get no, no need to see a permit, please. Oh, I got it. Sunset Island. 
A refreshing combination of pineapple juice, grape juice, lemon soda, and sugar syrup. Restores MP for all. Put insignia. A mystical charm imbued with the power of the warrior that raised the attack power and hit rate of the wearer. Whoa. That's pretty good. Yeah, boost strength and hit. Nice. Alright, well let's go pickpocket some more people before we talk to these people. Alright, so we did everybody on this screen. We did everybody in that room over here. Still have this place right here. They got a robe? I'll take it, I guess. That weird clothing. A weirdly designed outfit that is a bit embarrassing to wear. Welcome to the trendiest shop in all of Cross. We only sell the latest in high street fashion. Oh, a day's bomb. Take it. I don't know if you can pickpocket from these guys or not. Oh, you actually can. Yeah, make sure to buy the skills here if you haven't already. I didn't think he'd let you steal from the shopkeepers. Sapphire from that one. Mandrake from that one, but it's not guaranteed. There we go, got it. I mean, it's still from this guy. Come on. Takes a while to get some of these items. I'm not even sure stave setting even does anything. Let me leave the place and go back in. There we go. Magic clay. A lifeless piece of clay that when crafted into an object gains magical properties can only be used once. Okay, we've got some people up here too. Fountain pen. A pen designed so ink is loaded into an internal cartilage and flows out from the nib. You can only be used once.
Okay, iron. Anklet, okay. Just an ordinary anklet that offers some protection, okay. Alright, so we got... Pretty much looted, or stole from everybody around there. Over here is done as well. So we got this place over here. The restaurants. Okay, got some cola. Although its recipe is unknown, its refreshing taste is known all over the universe. Restores MP. We use every ingredient and serve every dish known to mankind. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Vegetables. Alright. Okay. Let's try some of these people over here then. Fifteen full, really? That's it. Five full. And ten full. I just gotta get this person up here. Five full. Alright. Well, wow, 900. I got 900 full there. Wait, did I talk to this dude over here? Nothing goes into our dishes except top quality ingredients and my top quality cooking. Let's talk to the people upstairs too. That had an interesting flavor. I wonder where that dish is from. I really liked it, actually. I'm having a hard time deciding whether I liked my meal or hated it. You think the dish just isn't all that good, or you think the chef messed up? Getting a ton of items, guys. Alright, now we gotta loot everybody back here as well. Rickety Knuckles. A pair of knuckles forged so carelessly that normal fingers won't even fit into them. Just gonna buy one of everything here. Round shield by that. Boots of happiness. Magical pair of boots that can free the mind of small worries. That's weird. There we go. Bought everything there. Dish of the day. 
A skill guide book. Readers can learn the recipe skill. How long has it been since the sorcery go blended on Aluria? Potion of Epiphany. A mystical potion that lets the user acquire a new talent for just one moment when using the status screen. Okay. You can buy anklets here, mandrakes, wolfbane. Buy one of those. Buy a resurrection elixir. Okay. Aqua berries. And are full. Rose de May. A delectable, a delectable blend of cream and pineapple and raspberry juices. There's all status elements and resuscitates for one. Artemis Leaf. Can't afford more than this one drink, so I'm going to drink it real quick, real slow. Hey, hurry up in there. Keurig's basically a tourist spot. The best way to enjoy it is to take, it is to take your time, like me. When you drink, drink hard. That's how you show respect to alcohol. We're already at 37 minutes, guys, and we're not done yet. Eight hundred full, nice. Five hundred full. Breeze earring. A diamond earring that raises the wear's agility. Nice. Welcome to Curic. A ship docked in the harbor right now. Liar. Okay, we pickpocketed everybody in the town, guys. Looking good. I think I'll go hit the town now. Shouldn't stay here about the others. Alright guys. I'm in the video here. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. And later.